just this knowledge alone. People don't know this. People with HIV don't know this and they need to. On February 15th of 2016 this year, I was diagnosed with HIV. Uh, 10 days later, I was diagnosed with pneumonia and AIDS. What I want you to know is my story. By doing some research, I found out who I got this from. I got it back in 2013 from a boyfriend that we'd been together for about eight months. Um, he didn't know he had it at the time and he, um, he had some high risk behavior. I did not, so this came into my life via somebody who had had high risk behavior. He um, was tested about three months after we split and because he had been getting sick and um, he didn't contact me to tell me that he was positive. He left my information, my name and number with the clinic. And when I finally started to figure out the puzzle, um, he said, they didn't call you. And so for two and a half years, I've been walking around with HIV and didn't know it. So since that time, I've gotten better, thank God. <laughs> but I can't make that clear enough that this is not scary. It's okay. Like I want people to know that HIV is not this scary, horrible thing. There's medication now that is amazing. We are so excited about this news. This is going to save lives. This is going to change stigma. This is going to change how people with HIV live and stay on their medications so that they won't transmit the virus to anybody else. It was a study with 888 couples that was done over several years. These were gay couples, these were heterosexual couples where one was positive, one was negative. The positive partner is virally suppressed. They don't use protection and they have sex. And over so many years, of watching these couples, 888 of them, 58,000 sexual encounters between these couples over so many years, the virus was not transmitted. Not one time was it transmitted. The freedom to know that if somebody's HIV positive and they are undetectable, that they will not pass on the virus. U equals U. Undetectable equals untransmittable.